his seventh year of ninja training coming up this month. Last year, or excuse me, two years ago, out on Monstro Swing in the teens division, uh, did not compete last year. So Brooks looking to make a statement by beating Stage One for the wow, first time that today. Was really great flow. Although he almost just uh, overshot short line, trying not to use his hands now, using his hands. Yeah, and I think these athletes know it is faster to just walk through without using the hands, but I think it was a smart choice. He didn't look super comfortable on that, but looking really comfortable all in the rest of the course, moving through so quickly. Yeah, I mean, he just flew through boardwalk. One of the faster paces to this point, even with a little bit of a stumble on Park Place, or excuse me, on Short Line. Hopefully he doesn't stumble on Park Place. Yeah, and the time is looking good to this point. I think, again, if I see the athletes getting through Bazooka Barrel with about 20 seconds or more, oh, I, got, I got feel stuck. confident. That's okay. Great kick, though, and actually was able, because of his long wingspan, to reach Bazooka Barrel while still holding onto the ring. Jamie having to push, co push Coach uh, Michael Johnson out of the way, <laughs> and now on to splat -a -lot, makes the first grab. He could be easily our fastest here time if go, he makes Brooks. it here. The last jump. Easy yes, work. he has a couple more swings if he wants it. He's going to take one extra. That's a smart decision. Brooks Beaver, our fastest Wonderful. player so far. 113. He had plenty of time. Honestly, probably if he had wanted to, probably could have linked that last dismount. Um, well, why would you want to risk I, it? Yeah, why would you want to risk it? Save it, save it for stage two.